Good morning and welcome to day four of my Sydney road trip. All right, once again, it is now 6.30 a.m. and we're starting off with an early morning warm-up hike to National Falls. All right, so the goal here is just to get down to the bottom somehow. Once again. Oh. All right, so generally this is just a lookout. On the top. Oh, did I forget to mention it? it's not off track? <laughs> to the lower falls, it's a little bit of an off track, but I think this one takes us to the base of the upper falls. Uh, let's go this way and see where that, that leads us. Oh, that was a tough one minute hike down. <laughs> God, I love these short walks, boys. They're everywhere in Sydney. Not bad, huh? I wish there were more of these in Queensland. Alright, I think we're going to head down to the lower falls. And um, yeah, I'll catch you guys down there. Uh, probably 20 meters from the upper falls. This is the lower falls here. Just in case you're wondering why I'm moving so slowly. <laughs> All right, try to get down to the bottom here. Okay, this is the only off track part, which I'm unfamiliar with. I can see a little cave there, that's pretty cool. So the goal is to get back on the main road and hopefully find a way to cut down. Spent 15 minutes in the bush trying to find a way down. Turns out, further, <laughs> further along on the road, there's a set of stairs that takes you down to the trail. So this is the little kind of cave that I was looking at, um, standing on top. As like I said, this is a warm-up hike, so generally it's very easy. Tribute Falls, sandstone. Oh, that looks so cool. See that? And behind the bush is the, is the waterfall. Before we get down to the bottom, Let's walk behind it. This is neat. Cool cave too. How awesome is this? Not a bad start to your morning. Just want you guys to appreciate the overhang that this waterfall is coming down off. Beautiful forward. Check out the rest, there's another Chibudri Creek over there. Mining in my bush bash effort, hike time five minutes. Man, best bang for buck. Anyways, looks like there's a trail here. Hope I can get a nice shot looking up. All right, I climbed up this big ass boulder to give you guys an um, unobstructed view of the forest. All right, nice easy hike for a warm up. See you guys at Kelly's Falls. Welcome back. Missed the car park. And it's one of those windy roads where once you miss it, you're stuck until you go all the way down to the beach. Then you have to do a U-turn back up. So I said to myself, nope, stop it. I just pulled over and parked on the side of the road. And it's probably 300 meters through this fire trail, which obviously is not maintained um, to the car park. <laughs> so this is the car park. Kind of missed it. <laughs> Damn. <clears throat> it was a tiny little asphalt road that leads into it. And yeah, no excuses. 
just hit this. All right, we are there, Garawara. Oh, I have no idea. Okay, so today's goal is to start this yellow track, get down somehow, go to Curly's Creek, and then from there, Creek Hop down here, take a left, Creek Hop up, and then Skills uh, Falls. Uh, yeah, no preparation. Uh, I'm just gonna wing it. Didn't do any research on this, so. If I can make it down to the creek, I know I'm good. If I can't make it to the creek, that's pretty much the end of today's hike. Oh, look, there's a good chance I might see some platypus. Yeesh, nice. Okay, so that's the falls view from the top. Probably won't get there today. All right, let's get going. Is it this way or is it this way? I think I'm just going this way. Okay, so I can hear the waterfall, so from my understanding this is the black fence. I read, an, I read this quick article this morning and there's a way down here, there you go. So there's some before the next, oh look, footpath, would have found it. <laughs> okay. Alright, so there's a rope tethered here to down club. I'm assuming this is a shortcut. There's the trail. There's one that leads over here as well. Okay, so I fancy the shortcut, but look at these ropes. They're all weathered. So it's hard to trust them. But I've got my own. Alright, down we go. That didn't work well. Alright, um, the um, GoPro is not harnessed on. I'm too lazy, so it's going to be floppy. This one's a sheer drop. Well, wow. all right, gonna require upper body strength if you wish to do this. Okay, nice and easy. Sorry about that angle, there's nothing I can do about that. Actual trail here. So, look, I'm not, I'm not one to complain, but I was expecting to be bush bashing. So, quite pleased that I don't have to do that. Pretty easy. Woo, such an easy 10 minute less. Beautiful. Release for Rainbow. Oh, it's pretty neat guys here's the lower fours I guess and giant boulders this is the creek we have to navigate all right whether I should I stay on the creek or go as far as I can before I head down to the creek all right you know what I'll see how far I have to go before I have to head down looks manageable this looks like it's well worn. Creek's got a lot of boulders. As long as I still can see the creek on my left hand side, I'm staying on the trail. It's with the junction of Gills Creek. And back up because it looks like I missed the junction between Gills Creek and this creek here. Totally forgot the name. Curly's Creek. That's it. So I'm going back up to look for the junction. So the creek has to be on the other side. Things over there. All right, let me get across the creek and see if I can find it. It turns out there's no creek hopping involved. The falls is right there. I can't believe how easy this hike is. There's not much to record on this easy hike. 
you might as well watch me try to get up there boulder on top of boulder Decent drop, huh? Woo. All right, guys. Oh no, my feet's weird. God damn it, I was looking up. Ah, oh, so sad. <laughs> All right, I was really hoping not to have my feet wet. Still sulking over my wet foot. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, here it is. Bill's Forge. Beautiful, eh? I'm back to the roped section. Turns out, go further down, there's an easy scramble up. So, well, today was a lot, lot easier than I expected. I thought this is gonna take me two hours. I took half that time. Mainly because I didn't have to creek hop much, or at all, to be honest. Only to cross the creek to get to the waterfall. All right, I, was, I might as well rest and go home and get ready for a big day tomorrow all right short two hour trip um that's pretty much it catch you guys next time see ya